Okay, so I've done my work, so now I want to have myself a truly indulgent a UK recipe, which is trifle. It's very easy because you don't have to make everything from scratch. Obviously, if I were in my kitchen in France, I would do the custard and everything from scratch. But today I decided to go the easy way and to take some already made custard from an amazing place in London. And so we're gonna make some very easy trifles that you can make in your office because I'm going to do it today. So let's get baking and you're gonna see how wonderful it tastes. Pour tous mes abonnés français, ne vous inquiétez pas, la vidéo sera sous-titrée en français et vous pouvez aussi retrouver la recette en français sur mon site internet. Donc je vais mettre les deux versions, donc anglaise et française. Et je vais bien sûr tourner des vidéos françaises très prochainement. Donc ne vous inquiétez pas, tout va bien se passer. For my trifle, I'm going to use very simple ingredients, but very delicious ones. Starting off with some cake, of course, since we need some cake in our trifle. And I've got a pretty thick uh, layer of cake that I'm going to, uh, first of all, slice and then cut to the size of my uh, little plastic glasses. I'm going to cut each slice in three just to fit my cup. Moving on to the fruit, and I'm using kiwis today because obviously it is green as Tenzo's logo and I'm just going to cut some slices. I do love some kiwis. It is now time to assemble our trifles and so for that I'm going to use some raspberries, blueberries, of course the kiwis that I have peeled and sliced. I'm also going to use for a bit of crunch some meringues. I'm also going to use some very jiggly custard and finally the pieces of cake that I've just uh, sliced even more because now they are thinner as you can see and now we can assemble. I'm going to start with a layer of fruit. Now some blueberries, of course. And I'm adding one or two raspberries. I'm now adding the custard very carefully. In goes the meringue for some crunch. I just added the cake and pressed it down and now I'm going to do everything the same way. The fruit, the cream, the meringue and the cake and everything goes in.
As you can see, I made some whipped cream with, of course, some whipping cream and some vanilla extract using beaters. And as you can see, I've made two versions of our trifle. One only putting some whipping cream on top and fruit, and the other one using whipping cream, but also uh, the meringue that we used and some curd and fruits. Whether you put the meringue on or not, don't worry, it will be all just very good and awesome. Okay, so now you can put it in the fridge and let it set for two or three hours. Or you can enjoy it right away and eat it with your co-workers. This is what I'm going to do. Cheers! So if you want more information about Tenzo, please visit their website. Uh, you can get a free demo if you want. There is also an app, it's amazing. So if you want to do that, the links are below this video. If you want to make this recipe, you can find it entirely written on my blog, williamskitchenblog.com. You can find the recipe in French and in English. You can also follow me on my social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and Snapchat. All the links are below this video and please, Give me a like if you liked it, and I see you next time. Bye!